Kiorana, everyone. We're here in Rarotonga in the Cook Islands. Super excited to be here. We're gonna be here for about six beautiful days. Of course, you see it's raining right now, and it's absolutely lovely here. We're staying here at Ikurangi Eco Retreat. We are staying in one of the luxury tents here. The property is super beautiful. It's green, we got beautiful fruit trees and plants all around us. Uh, there's a pool over there. Uh, we're gonna enjoy this nice breakfast and get ready for our day. We really enjoyed our stay at Ikarangi Eco Retreat. They served a delicious and healthy breakfast every morning. The property was super tranquil, and this was one of three hotels we stayed in during our stay in Raro. We paid around $320 New Zealand per night. We just picked up our rental car. Now we're gonna just cruise around the island, see some cool spots before we head off to a bite to eat. First stop on our list was Vibe Fish Van, which is only a few minutes away from the airport. They had delicious food and sat on one of the most beautiful spots of the lagoon. We shared the seafood pack and paid around $17 New Zealand, and it was absolutely delicious. God damn, that's good. And it's got an ice cream, iced coffee. This is absolutely delicious. Wonderful. Cheers. Our next stop would be Mary Beach, where we would spend the majority of our time on our trip. The water here is tranquil, shallow, and perfect for swimming. You will find a few nice resorts to have food and drinks, and some fantastic restaurants all conveniently within walking distance. Making our way up to the Miri Night Market. It's open Sunday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday from 5 p.m. A lot of people here, so heard get here early. The Miri Night Market is a great way to eat local food at a reasonable price. It offers outdoor seating with some covering, and there's a variety of foods to choose from. We ate here twice during our stay and loved it. Day two here in Rarotonga. We're actually off to go grab some proper coffee at a place called Love Cafe, which is only about a few minute drive from us here. Yeah, very lovely. You hear the beat of those drums going on right now. It's like all the tours head over to this little motu over here across the way. Now we're right in front of the Mary Beach Club Hotel. Definitely lovely when the sun's out. This water just looks like a light bulb. Got turned on right underneath the water here. my first time touching the water here in Rarotonga. It's absolutely gorgeous. The water is actually a little cool, cooler than when we were in French Polynesia a little bit. Uh, the weather is also a little bit cooler, but it's also very pleasant, so I'm very happy to be here. The water is crystal clear. Didn't ask for much better water than this. Not the place to go over here unless I want to end up over there. My goodness, the current is strong over here. Uh, but just happy to get my feet wet. Literally, super beautiful. Give her a ride of contact. Great time over at Mary Beach. Now we're going to head off to grab something to eat and probably call it an early night.
So, so this kitty we actually found in our bed right between us at around 4 a.m. An unexpected visitor. <laughs> but uh, she's very cute. And she's enjoying that fish curry. We loved our stay here. It was extremely tranquil and we had a wonderful breakfast every morning. But we're looking forward to checking into a new hotel. We're going to be staying at Moana Sands Beachfront Hotel, which is about 13 minutes away from us. We checked into Moana Sands Beachfront Hotel and paid around $285 New Zealand per night. The room was clean and comfortable and was right on one of the nicest beaches on the island. They have lounge chairs to relax on the beach and provided snorkeling equipment, stand-up paddle boards, and kayaks. It really was a great hotel to relax and unwind for a few days. We just arrived back at our new accommodation. Mary Shores, super excited to be staying here for a few nights. It's right on the beach. Check out this view, you guys. Right here on a beautiful beach. Some bungalows right up front here. Not sure which one we're in. Our room will be ready shortly. The drums you hear are from a tour going on. Captain Thomas Lagoon Cruises. All right, turns out we just arrived and we get to jump on this tour. The last two spots available. We're super excited. They were not available. Somebody got lost. Actually, somebody got lost, so hey, lucky us for sure. We're ready to depart. Got a beautiful day here on Miri Beach. Ready to jump in the water and enjoy it. Everybody, Kia Rana! Kia Rana! Welcome aboard, Captain Thomas and Good Cruises. Are you ready to have some fun today? We booked our tour with Captain Thomas Lagoon Cruises and paid around $100 New Zealand per person. Our first stop was to snorkel in the crystal clear lagoon waters. Our next stop was to a beautiful Motu for a great lunch and show. We were well entertained with lots of laughs and we really enjoyed the music. Hey you go Matayo! Oh, Alright. Enjoy my man. Thank you very much. Yeah, that's a lunch right there. Thank you very much. Thanks Mike. so far at Captain Tama's Lagoon Cruises. Beautiful show, great lunch, Saw we had some great snorkeling, and, and now we're enjoying this beautiful water here. Absolutely perfect. Our last accommodation was Miri Shores. It has a great location right on the beach and was possibly our favorite place we stayed in throughout our entire trip. The room was spacious and clean, it had a small kitchen and fridge, 
a nice terrace to relax, and it was so nice hearing the ocean waves from the most comfortable bed. We paid around 216 New Zealand dollars per night. Yeah, dude. Right next to us is another place to grab a drink. We got the, the yacht club over here in Rarotonga. And actually our tour took off right here too, right next to us. So again, great location here. I oh, mean, sorry, the Rarotonga Sailing Club. The highlight of our trip was meeting and hanging out with our new friends from Captain Thomas. We were even lucky enough to get a private cultural dance. Thank you from the bottom of our hearts for making us feel so welcome. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Captain Thomas! Yeah, buddy! She stole my bloodline. We're at that beautiful waterfront today, and the brother Matayo on the side! Let's go! That is Captain Sharky right there. This is Captain Fabulous right over here. Welcome, welcome to Captain Thomas. This is what we do every day. Let's go! Beautiful day here in Rarotonga. I'm gonna go back and try to rent a car and we're gonna head over to the market uh, which sells some local goods and some food and so we're gonna go check that out. Most car rentals required a minimum of three days due to demand and others were quite expensive last minute. But we found the bus system super easy to get around. You'll see buses about every 30 minutes or so and a round trip ticket was around $8 New Zealand. We made it to the Punanga Nui Market, which opens every Wednesday and Saturday morning. Get ready to shop, eat, and get a taste of culture in the Cook Islands. <laughs> to close out our trip, we made it back to the Morning Fish Cafe for the second time, this time with some live music. Their fish sandwich was absolutely incredible. I want to thank you all for watching my video. If you're considering a trip to the Cook Islands, get ready for stunning beaches, fantastic snorkeling, delicious food, and some of the friendliest people you'll ever meet. Our experience here was incredible and will absolutely return to this beautiful island. If you enjoyed this content, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. I'll catch you all in the next video.